is this real? You know, like you, there's this thing in your head where it's like, oh, it's got to be perfect because that's how people want to hear music. But it's, I don't think it is, you know. Pinnipack Creek is rising beneath the shadow of the stars. City is growing restless without you in its all. You have a certain way of making a record when you're in a professional studio and you're in New York City and we just kind of wanted to get away from that. It's like just what we all have going on in our lives. We, it's a great thing for us to just be able to step away from all of that. Uh, through the last couple months we've been trading mp3s and, and um, I'll send him a song by someone else that I think is cool that might be sort of in you know in his neck of the woods and and he'll send me a song that he thinks is cool so we've been having a conversation through, through songs and through his songs <laughs> they're just gonna go <laughs> wow thank you welcome <laughs> when you got a flat tire yeah, yeah. <laughs> he just told me about his idea that he wanted to come up here and record uh, in the barn setting and and I thought that was a cool idea, and so I said, yeah. some of that the wind and the birds and the dogs walking around and you know just and people sitting next to each other playing music I think that when you when you break it down um, to a more of a scientific level, you know, like a minutia level, then you take something out of it. You know, you might have a perfect take after that, but you definitely take something, remove some soul from it. I think, you know, and uh, hopefully we can capture as much soul as we can. You know?